decision of the day. Where the heck do I store my Wonder Woman shield? I really have no idea. Where do I put my shield, Brady? Where do I put it? <laughs> Did it fall out when you open it? But hey, it fits. Oh, you got your toy. Hey, you got your toy. No. What are you even doing? I don't want it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Funny thing is they wouldn't play when they went outside, but he gets in here and he's just, it's just craziness. Big battle. Oh, get it. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> get it, bus. Get it. What's up guys? All right, I'm chilling here with Frosty. Hey, Brady. What's up, Brady? <laughs> Just chilling here at the trailer. It's Sunday evening and by myself, Matt has been in New Orleans. Let me set the tripod down for a second. All right, Matt is in New Orleans for a bachelor party. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. They're coming back tomorrow. Why anybody's bachelor party needs to be five days, don't ask me. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I've just been hanging out this weekend. Um, I went over to my parents and that's really all I've been doing is hanging out with them, being antisocial in the trailer. Get to bed around eight. It's been pretty nice to be honest. I did pick up a few other Christmas decorations for the trailer just because I wanted to, so I'm gonna show you guys those. I'm pretty ready for Matt to be home. Just, I just miss him thinking about it a lot and I, I really want to travel really want to travel. Driving around this weekend I passed a ton of trailers and class A's and all of these people on the go and I'm just sitting there thinking like man I want to, I want to go somewhere so bad. We just have to be patient. Um, financially right now we definitely can't travel. We're in the perfect setup as far as finances go being here on his parents land i can't even imagine if we had a rent at this time with the extra bills that we've had i can't imagine where i i mean i don't think we would be able to pay everything it's crazy at the same time that you know all of this stuff is unfortunate what's happened with buzz and matt's leg it's also crazy how it's worked out for us being in a trailer because as i said we wouldn't have been able to pay for a lot of this stuff had we had to pay $1,200 in rent on top of everything else. So it's kind of amazing how things work out like that. Take time to count your blessings and, you know, thank God for everything that we have because despite everything that we've been going through, we're still healthy and alive and together. The dogs are getting rowdy. So I don't know, I'm just kind of rambling right now. Yeah, I really, really want to just go somewhere. But the next few weeks, as we keep saying, it's gonna be really busy. We've actually got a family photo shoot on Saturday with my family. It's a gift that we, um, the kids put together for my mom because we don't have many family pictures and anytime the whole family's together, she always tells us that she wants to take a picture, but we're all very reluctant and we end up not taking a picture or it's not very good. So we're paying to have uh, the same photographer that did my fitness picture, she did bridal pictures, she did our engagement pictures, our wedding pictures, so we love her and so she's gonna take our family pictures on Saturday. 
then we're gonna have a big day hang out with the family Matt and I are gonna see about going to comic-con in Austin although the tickets are about $40 each so that might not be something that we can afford to be honest but then next week is Thanksgiving so we've got my family and then hanging out with Matt's family um, my brother's gonna be back in town so we're gonna be spending a lot of time with him and his wife and then I think we'll probably try and pack as much Christmas stuff into the next several weeks as we can before he has to go back on the oil rig so we'll probably be doing a lot of Christmas stuff if we're gonna travel at all that might be a time where we can do a small trip there's mosquitoes out here it's November and there's mosquitoes that might be a time that we can do a small trip whenever after Thanksgiving but again because then Christmas is coming up. We have two weddings. One wedding is December 16th, um, and we're both in that wedding. So I still need to pay for the rest of my bridesmaid's dress. Matt has to rent his tux. And then we've got wedding present, rehearsal dinner with him, wedding, it's mid-December. Um, and then the following week, I think is Christmas. And then we have a wedding to go to the day after Christmas. So yeah, it's a busy, busy holiday season, but things that I love, I really, love the holidays as you guys can see i'm just ready for matt to be back um i just again bachelor parties i don't i don't get it so but one of the cool things about new orleans is we got engaged there so i told him to make sure and go by the spot in front of the cathedral um where we got engaged and he sent me a picture of the bench like right in front of uh he proposed to be right in front of the bench so that was pretty nice um but he should be heading back tomorrow and then we'll have a semi-normal week that's about it i just kind of want to update you guys on what i've been up to nothing eating a lot spending time with the dogs watching movies hung out with my uh, nephew this weekend that's what i've been up to let me show you guys the um extra ooh, the ground is wet our decorations that i picked up so we got this little thing well, I got this little thing. It says it's the most wonderful time of the year and it's right next to this pumpkin that I'm ready to chuck. And then the only other things that we, I got, I keep saying we, excuse the RV, it's a mess right now because I just got home and I'm unpacking everything. So it's a mess. So I'm gonna, I'm just using the reverse camera on my phone. I got three little stockings and they all have bees on them and I got one for Buzz, I got one for Brady, and I got one for, I got one for Burgundy. Um, and I know a lot of you guys have been um, asking for updates on Burgundy. And to be honest, I haven't talked about it because she's still not back. And so I thought that maybe if I get her a stocking, she'll come back. So yeah, Burgundy's still gone, but she's got her stocking. I just hope she's okay. But Buzz and Brady are all fine, healthy, and Matt's healthy. I'm healthy. Our families are healthy, so we have a lot to be thankful for. I just, I just pray that little Bergy is okay, wherever she is. But, oh man, I didn't mean to turn this into a crying video. So that's going to be the update for now. And I am working on um, care packages for November. On a more positive note, I actually found blankets at Walmart. And this unfolds to a pretty good size. Um, I'm starting off with three because I'm working on our first three care packages for November. And I'm going to start doing blankets, although it's quite warm right now. When it gets cold here, it gets it's like a dry cold. I can't imagine being out on the street um, in the cold, so getting blankets. Anyway, um, I'm going to go compose myself. I'm going to make some dinner, clean the trailer, and then I will see you guys on Wednesday's update back with Matt. So I just wanted to do this little update video. If you guys enjoyed the update, have any feedback, comments, anything, chat below. I always like reading you guys' comments. I really, really do love talking with you guys. So hope you're having a wonderful day. I guess Matt at this point would say, have fun out there. And I would say, bye. <laughs>